Hello there! Welcome to this concept art tutorial. I am here in Alchemy, a free software you can download on the internet. There is a version for Windows, Mac, and Linux. We are going to create random and abstract images very fast to kickstart thumbnails for concept art. If you move your mouse up here, you'll find the tool panel. You can find the style in the first place. You can pick the thin or thick style. In the thin style, you'll pretty much just get a line, a normal line. With the thick style, you're gonna get thicker shapes. This is pretty much the only layer system that Alchemy has. It's just over and under of what you already have. Uh, this is the line weight. You can pick any color that you want here. And if you want a specific color, you can click there, pick your specific color. There is no undo button in Alchemy, so you have to embrace the happy accident. You only have the clear button, but you get rid of everything. So I'm going to start with a thick style over. And I'm gonna go a low transparency to start from light to dark. Here you can pick all the shapes that you want and you can only pick one at a time. Here you can pick the effects on those shapes and you can pick more than one at a time. So I'm gonna pick displace and gradient. For now I'm gonna start with type shapes because I can control the size and I want to start with a pretty big size to cover my canvas very fast. So I'm going to click and drag and these random shapes are going to start appearing on my canvas. I like type shapes because uh, you start getting this sense of perspective in the, in the composition. However, I, I do not have complete control over this image. I'm just clicking and dragging randomly and these shapes are happy. I'm going to bump up the transparency a bit and I'm going to pick full shapes because I can also adjust the size. I'm going to pick circles folder and I'll only get the circles shapes. After that, I'm going to pick the bones folder to get the bones shapes. I'm gonna pick X shapes. You can see this is a different type of effect in the shapes. However, they're still random and great enough to start awesome compositions for concept art. gonna go with the very heavy blacks and I'm gonna pick full shapes again and the tanagram fold. As you can see random shapes. Now I'm gonna go uh, I'm gonna change the color to white and I'm gonna lower the transparency in order to bring those lights up again. I'm going to pick the parts folder to see what it can bring to the table. I'm 
just again gonna go back to a darker color and do all shapes at a time. Great, that's it. Uh, after that, you can export in File, Export. Save it as a JPEG. I'm gonna call it. Uh, 